Hey guys, good morning. Can you guys do me a favor? Wake me up when Tesla hits $3,000 a share. Let's get into it. Now, I did not have this on my 2025 bingo card, okay? I did not have the news that Elon Musk was gonna buy over $1 billion in shares of Tesla stock. Last Friday, I remember watching the chart at the very open of the market on Friday, it was just going up and up and up all the way from $370 a share all the way to 395. And a form was just submitted and it was all Elon Musk buying at the open. That's how he rolls. He always buys and sells on the open market and you'll see this massive volatility, whether it's to the upside or the downside when it comes to Elon Musk. And so he buys a billion dollars, guys, worth of Tesla shares at probably trading at 150 PE or more. That should tell you guys something. That should tell you what is going to happen in the next five to 10 years. Now, there was, that's the first catalyst that you should be aware of when it comes to the AI revolution is Elon Musk doubling down on Tesla shares. The second indicator was those Oracle earnings last week. Okay, Oracle is projecting $144 billion in the next four years, guys. $144 billion. Well, what does that mean? That means they are ramping up data centers for the next four to five years because all of these major companies are investing in, in the AI revolution. And what does Tesla have that no one else has in this country? It's the battery technology. That battery technology is what is gonna, is what is gonna power the next five to 10, 20 years. Okay, and that's not to mention the robots and these robo-taxis. There is no reason why Elon Musk would buy a billion dollars worth of shares if he didn't know he didn't have something. I'm telling you guys, you gotta be aware of what is going on in the world. You cannot get sidetracked into politics and be biased when it comes to the AI revolution that's happening because you'll miss out on the next move. That's what's happening. People are getting sucked into these black holes and not paying attention to what's really going on. And no one's talking about it. No one out there in the media is talking about what's happening with AI. And it's scary. It's scary to be honest. And again, I've talked about this in a previous video. Holding Tesla stock is a hedge against dystopia, okay? It's a hedge against dystopia because the government does not, is not interested in AI and, and the effects it has on humans in general when it comes to the workforce, okay? We're gonna see a concentration of jobs, a concentration of wealth in the next five to 10 years. And we're gonna see the world change dramatically, okay? The wealthier are gonna get wealthier and the people who are not invested are gonna be left behind, guys. And so I, I'm not a financial professional. I can't tell you what to do, when to do it, how to do it. This is just my opinion. Take all the spare cash you can muster up Go dig under the couch cushions and go put it in the AI revolution. Whatever stocks you feel are fit for that revolution, you could also look into AI ETFs. They're out there, Google it, you'll find them. And you'll be thanking yourself in 10 to 20 to 30 years. You'll be part of this, this small group of people who are gonna have way more wealth than the rest, okay? The rest of the people, are going to have what's called UBI, Universal Basic Income. This is going to happen because these robots are going to come out. When these robots come out, every company is going to, we're going to see deflation dramatically. Every company is going to buy these robots and they're going to be able to produce goods and services at the, at the cheapest rate they can get to, you know, whether it's AI agents, um, on the LLM side, or whether it's the robots on the physical side. This is gonna happen, guys, whether you like it or not, whether you're falling into these traps of politics, doom and gloom, whatever it is, you need to pay attention 
to what is happening. And the fact that Elon Musk goes out and buys a billion dollars of Tesla shares at pretty much the all-time highs. I mean, the previous all-time highs were like 414 a share, and it went up to 490, but that was because of the Trump effect, you know, Elon Musk and Trump. But man, guys, that is insane. I did not think that was going to happen. And they have something. They have something in their facilities that no one really knows about, even though really it's all out there in, in public space. I mean, everyone talks about these Optimus robots. Everyone talks about these Robotaxis. All the Tesla Bulls, they will preach till the sun comes up about Tesla's AI initiatives and no one listens. No one at all. No one on the left, no one on the right. They just think, oh, it's just another car company. You know, forget the EV. It'll be found on the road dead because it'll run out of batteries. <laughs> Guys, most of these people who drive these Teslas, they love them. Yeah, there's a few people who probably, you know, get discouraged by them. Maybe they've had some problems. Sure. But when these robotaxis come out, it's going to disrupt the entire auto industry. Okay. And I'm going to do another video on it. I'll do a follow-up video. And it, it all has to do with really auto insurance at the end of the day. How that's going to disrupt the whole auto industry okay so so keep that in mind auto insurance is a big reason why um, the robo taxi is going to disrupt the auto industry so that's one thing and then this optimus robot you know they have this version 3 coming out which elon keeps saying that it's all in the hands the dexterity of the hands i think they're putting in like 28 separate actuators or something like that and I bet you each actuator has like its own AI model or something like that, you know, some crazy thing. But they're doing things at this company that no one in the world is doing. They have this visual intelligence pipeline that I keep talking about because I want you guys to understand this, to be positioned. Okay, whether or not you buy Tesla or not, I mean, now, now, you, now there's a 10% move today, which can be sold into. Um, but if you are looking to make a position in Tesla, I recommend this. I recommend you just nibble, okay? Nibble, dollar cost average, take small nibbles and, and just slowly add in if you are looking to, to get a position, if you've not had a position. Because I believe that after he bought a billion dollars, he sees something. He sees a 10x. There's no reason why you would put a, another billion dollars uh, on top of the other billion dollars of shares that he has. He's concentrating his position even further, which surprised me. I did not see that coming. And it just tells me that, you know, this stock is headed to $3,000 a share. It's headed to a 10x from 300. And that's been my... My strategy this whole time is to have a concentrated position just like all the other major wealthy people out there. Mark Zuckerberg, um, Elon Musk, um, Bill Gates, Larry Ellison, et cetera, et cetera. They all do the same thing. They all concentrate their positions. That is how you become uber super wealthy is you got to have a concentrated position. Even, you know, regular business owners, they do the same thing. They have a concentrated position in their business. They keep funneling all the profits back into their business because they have conviction. They have, you know, the vision of where they're taking that company. And Elon Musk has the exact same thing. Now, again, I can't tell you what to do with your money, where to put it. You know, there's a lot of other great AI companies out there. Uh, obviously, Palantir, Google, Meta as well. Meta tra trades pretty cheap. So does Google. I, I like Google, man. They're the biggest profit maker in the world. But I think Tesla's going to catch up, guys. I really do. I think that people are just underestimating, underestimating them. They always do. Every time in the media, whether it's the legacy media or even the social media, Gary Black and all these other investors, they always, they're always naysaying Tesla because they don't understand technology. They never have and they never will. They do not understand how technology compounds exponentially. It gets faster, better, smarter, smarter than humans. That's what's happening. That's why Elon Musk is investing because he sees that the AI is going to be smarter, better, faster than every human on the planet. And it goes across the board, not just electric vehicles, robots, LLMs, across the board, it's going to be better, smaster, better, faster, smarter than every human on the planet. Unfortunately, you know, unfortunately for us, we're going to have to figure out what to do, guys. We're going to have to be all YouTubers. I've said this in the past um, and just enjoy our life, you know. Wouldn't it be great if we could all just go out in the morning like I am right now 
and just shoot a video and enjoy our day. Maybe give your take, sip your tea, talk about, you know, maybe something you did with your family, um, listen to the birds, listen to the, the crickets. Maybe that's what life should be if we can have the robots do all of our bidding, bidding and we can have the cars come around and take us wherever we want to go. And we have UBI help us do that. You know, I don't know what that looks like. It's going to be a weird thing down the road, but I think it's going to be a reality, to be honest. So I'm excited. Um, obviously, it's good news for me from a Tesla stock perspective. I am not selling that stock. So wake me up when Tesla hits 3000 a share, you know, wake me up and then maybe, you know, I'll, I'll consider maybe holding the stock or selling the stock. I don't know. It all depends on where the company is when the stock's at $3,000 a share. We'll see what happens. But it's only a 10x from here. It's not a, it's not a huge move when you, when you look at stock market moves in general. You see Nvidia went from like 100 and some dollars all the way up to, you know, I don't know what it was pre-split, 1200, 1500, whatever. That's a 10x. You know, these things happen all the time in the stock market. Usually markets always price in future earnings and they get excited and they get exuberant and um, that's just what happens a lot of times. So, you know, it could get there pretty quick and then obviously die down like it has in the past due to, you know, hype and all that. But we'll see what happens. Um, I don't think it'll happen overnight. I think it'll reach 3,000 a share in probably five years, maybe 2030. If they can sell a million robots according to Elon's little pay package, not that he really needs it. But um, yeah, it is what it is. You know, don't be biased with your politics when it comes to Elon Musk and, uh, and Tesla. It's a company, it's not a, it's not a man. It's not a man with politics. It's a company of engineers. The best, the brightest, the United States has to offer. That is what people are forgetting in this nation. We have the best and the brightest running Silicon Valley and running these tech firms. Okay, so you can't forget about that. You wanna be part of it. That's how you're gonna keep up with the Joneses in this world. It's gonna be hard to keep up with the Joneses in general because inflation is gonna keep going, keep rising. And the only thing that's gonna keep up and beat it is AI. That's the bottom line, guys. It's not Bitcoin, it's not uh, gold, it's AI, period, okay? So let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Are you buying or are you selling Tesla after this move? Let me know in the comments below. And if you guys could like and subscribe to the channel, take a look at my previous video. And everyone, have a beautiful morning. Later.